Hi folks, Will McNichol here. I've just finished another community composition. This is where I create a short piece of music against the clock, inspired by suggestions by you lovely lot out there on the internet. And this one is another one inspired by suggestions from the folks over on Patreon. This one's a little different because I actually asked my patrons to send me some inspiring photographs and images for me to pick to create a piece of music for. And I had lots of lovely uh, submissions, but this one from Nico and Mel was the winner. I think it's a beautiful image, that kind of like dark woodland vibe with the dim light of the sun kind of piercing through all of those trees there. It just was very, you know, it's very atmospheric and I loved that. And we teamed that up with a tuning suggestion, which was open G minor. We had lots of tuning suggestions this time around. Um, we had uh, dad gad, we had open D, um, but G minor just seemed to suit this image, to my mind anyway, so I put that into the pot as well. We also had the suggestion of a bit of staccato scattered in there, and this kind of idea of a melody inspired by the harp, where you get like melody notes on adjacent strings so that the harmonies blend together. So I thought I could try and incorporate a little bit of that. Nico, who took the photo um, here, also shared the fact that the words that came to his mind when he took this photo were, let the dim light in, which again I thought was very evocative. So I've kind of leaned on that a little bit for the title of this piece, and I've called it uh, Dimming of the Light. And with that G minor dark tuning, I had a lot of fun creating this piece. And as you can see here, as I'm whizzing through the process, I was trying all sorts of ideas to begin with just to come up with a main melody and I wanted something a little bit intricate, maybe that used um, you know, slurs, like a collection of fast sounds and pull-offs, which kind of, to me, conjured up that image of all that kind of detail in the photo of the uh, branches of the trees. But I also wanted to have this kind of constant texture underneath it, so I decided to go with this kind of drone of an open third string G, which kind of carried on as a bit of a theme uh, throughout the piece, and I would add the melody on top of that. I was able to add staccato in moments like this, add a little bit of that articulation detail, and then that suggestion of that harp-like melody where the melody notes go on adjacent strings and cascade together. I um, managed to incorporate that in moments like this here as well. And then after about two hours, I had myself a finished piece of music. And then it was down to getting it recorded. It was a bit fiddly, <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I think it took me about four or five takes before I got a version that I was happy with. and. All that's left to do now is play it to you, and I really hope you enjoy it, and I'd really love to hear your thoughts in the comments as well. A huge thanks to everyone on my Patreon for supporting my work and for making these suggestions. I also give away a signed copy of the score to one of my patrons every time I do one of these, and the recording the tab is available for them as well. So if you fancy checking out my Patreon, then please do. Right then, here we go. This is Dimming of the Light. <laughs> Thank you. 
So there we go, that was Dimming of the Light, my fifth community composition. I so enjoyed putting that together and I really hope you enjoyed listening. Please do let me know what you thought of it in the comments. And one more big thank you to the lovely people over on Patreon. Thanks so much for watching, have a fabulous day and I'll catch you very soon.